It's time once again for another episode of the Radio Adventures of Dr. Floyd. This week we join our heroes deep in the depths of the time and space dream on Dr. Floyd's time and spaceship. Dear Princess Ori. Hey, Dr. Dr. Floyd, I'm going to go down to the Saddle River Penny Candy store. You want me to pick you up some penny candy? Oh, penny candy. You know, in my day we used to have penny candy, but it used to only cost... Well, a penny. Mm -hmm. How much money you got there? Oh, uh, let's see. One, two, three, four. Fifteen cents. Oh, but hey, you can't spend that. Look how dirty it is. Well, Dr. Floyd, nobody cares about dirty pennies. Yes, they do. No protege of mine's going to be caught spending dirty pennies. Well, how am I supposed to clean them? I mean, they don't exactly sell penny cleaner at the supermarket. Yes, they do. But it's called vinegar. And vinegar penny cleaner is this week's experiment adventure. <laughs> Where does that music come from? Never mind, Dr. Grant. All right, whippersnappers, here's what you'll need for this week's experiment. A glass dish. Quarter cup of vinegar. One teaspoon of salt. Now let's get started. Okay, first, fill your glass dish with one quarter cup of vinegar. Okay. Now put in one teaspoon of salt and stir it until all the salt dissolves. All right. Now, put your pennies into the glass dish. Now, do we have to stir this or anything? Nope, all you have to do is sit and wait. Oh, okay. Uh, uh Dr. Floyd, nothing's happening. Oh, well, you have to wait five minutes. Oh, okay. Dr. Floyd, can't we just use a time and space travel device to go ahead five minutes and see my clean pennies? That's a great idea! Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay. All right, Dr. Grant, hold on, here we go! Okay. Whew, that's always fun. Yep. Hey, look, my pennies are clean. How'd that happen? Well... Your pennies got all dull looking because oxygen in the air combined with the copper to create a dull copper oxide coating. The acid in the vinegar reacted chemically and removed the oxide from the penny, leaving you with nice, shiny pennies. Pennies proper enough for a protege of mine to spend at the penny candy store. Now remember kids, rinse off the vinegar before you spend your pennies. Golly, thanks, Dr. Floyd. You're welcome. You know, these pennies are way too shiny to be spent. I know just what to do. What's that? These little beauties need to go into my collection. I, uh, but my candy. Candy rot your teeth, Dr. Grant. Oh, brother. If you'd like the instructions for this experiment, they're up at our website at www.drfloyd.com. Go there and click on Experiments. That's www.doctorfloyd.com. And click on the link that says Experiments. Tune in next time for the next exciting episode of the Radio Adventures of Dr. Floyd. Give him to me.